Hey everybody, Joe Casaboni here, and today I want to tell you about a new piece of gear I picked up. It's the Audio Technica AT8035. It is a shotgun mic, and I got it for a few reasons. So if you have seen some of my courses or some of my videos here on this channel, you have noticed that I have a super crisp looking camera. You can see the, the background is blurred behind me. I have a nice lens. It's the Sony a6400. I will link uh, a video in the description below on how I set that up. But you might have also noticed that this mic was always in the way. And in the first Sony video I made, there's actually a focus on the microphone instead of my face. So maybe it was not noticeable to people who don't know me very well, but you might have you might have seen that I was a little bit uncomfortable or stiff because I didn't want to bump the microphone. I didn't want to make the camera focus on the microphone instead of me once I got it set up. And there was just a lot of work involved in making sure that the, the picture was framed just right. So I got a shotgun microphone. Again, that's the AT8035. It's right here. I'm like just hovering in front of the in front of the front of the microphone. I got this one because it's a long barrel. It's 12 or 14 inches and it's got a good pickup pattern for indoors. It is an outdoor. It's like it's like advertised as a field microphone, but it's got a great low pass filter on it so that it eliminates certain environmental sounds, which I need to do here in my office because it's my basement. So I got it for those reasons. And I got it so that there's no microphone in frame anymore. I have a little bit more freedom to move my hands. I talk a lot with my hands. Uh, I don't have to worry about anything uh, messing up or, or me hitting this microphone here. And I have a bit more freedom to change the frame. So this camera is in, is on an articulating arm so I can move it back and forwards. I can swing it out this way if I want to. And with the microphone attached to the top of the camera, I can change that frame however I want. With this, I was basically only locked to a few positions like here or just anywhere this arm swung. So. I was kind of limited to this area, but now I can, if I want to show you, you know, the rest of my office here, I can do that. So I'm, I'm glad the office is clean because I was unprepared for this. But so I have a little bit more freedom with the shotgun microphone. I don't have to worry about bumping this or the focus of the camera changing to the microphone. And I still get a nice sound from this microphone. So I'm sure I'll have more thoughts in the future. These are just my initial thoughts once I got the mic dialed in to how I wanted it to sound. But uh, if you have any questions about a shotgun mic or any gear, leave them in the comments below. I'd love to hear about what you're using and how it's working for you. If you liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more great content.